Yo, 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 Will Reagan from Reagan Reefs and Reptiles. A little bit different video than we've been doing. This is going to be a brief product review video. And it's a product that I haven't really seen anybody else review. It's fairly obscure. It's not something you see a whole lot of. Um, this is the ZooMed Terra FX Nano LED with sound effects. Um, it's a light. It's a terrarium light. Uh, the reason I don't think you see a lot about it is because it's kind of different than other reptile lights in that it really doesn't do anything for your reptile. Uh, the reason I say that is, I mean, the two main things that our animals are going to get from lights is going to be UVB, which this does not provide any, um, and heat and or heat one or the other and this also does not provide heat so this is not a basking light it's not a uvb light it's if i call it anything it's it's like a beauty light basically um it um it's fairly bright i mean you can make it bright it's really adjustable you can really tune the colors into exactly how you like them um, there's a bunch of channels like a reef light and that's kind of what i relate it to other uh, lights we have for our reef tanks where we can actually you know adjust the light spectrum the colors everything uh, with a remote and it does have a built-in timer so you can set it to come on uh, in the morning you know do a sunrise effect tune in the color you want the daylight to be you can have it sunset at night tune in the night color um, it's got bands for like white UV red green um, all your you know several different colors blue so you can tune it to look more like daylight during the day more of a blue ocean type light during the day um, you can make it red at night for nocturnal guys or you can make it blue at night like moonlight you can make it just purple or kind of a UV color at night um, so it's pretty cool in that way but like I said it's really a light for light for visuals it doesn't provide UVB. It does provide UVA, but that's not really, you know, the deep U. That's not really the UV that your reptiles need. They need UVB. I mean, UVA is good too, but most all these daylights provide UVA. It's UVB radiation that you're really looking for to help them process calcium and keep them from getting metabolic bone disease. So don't get this light thinking that this will cover the UVB requirements of your reptile. If they have them. Um, this is on a ball python little tank that we've got going, just a little display. So they don't really need UV, so that's not a big deal. Um, we do have a, a Baskin light on that tank as well for heat, and then we have a, an under heat, uh, an under tank heat tape as well. So we're not relying on this for light, for heat or UVB, neither one, um, just for the visuals. So we're going to go in here and we're going to see what this thing actually does. What you can make it do, the different features of it. So it's a small, you know, small LED. It fits nicely on the top of any tank. Um, this one's on a 40 breeder critter cage. Right now, it's on auto, which means it, it goes off and on by itself. It does sunrise, sunset, all that good stuff. Um, all right, so I can take it off of auto to show you the daylight color. So when I hit the day mode, it'll go to the daylight color that I have tuned in. And it has a sound effect that's like a babbling brook. I guess you can hear that. So it basically provides light to make the tank look pretty and it gives sound effects. Not really necessary, but still kind of cool. So that's the day mode. I can put it on the night mode and I've tuned that to be like a blue type of moonlight. And you'll notice when it goes to that, you get crickets chirping. It also has a plant growth mode. When I put it on that, that is supposed to be simulated the best spectrum for plants. And it plays like a jungle um, sound effect with that. Or it has a fish setting. 
which I guess is supposed to be ideal for a fish tank. Um, and that's like a whale soundtrack type of sound effect that it has. In addition to that, you can do thunderstorm and you'll see it'll flash like thunder and lightning. It'll make lightning, you know, thunder crash sound effects. It'll do all that. So that's basically what you got. You got a, you got a, a beauty light. It illuminates your terrarium. It has all these cool effects, sound effects, and visual effects for weather. You can have it ramp up and down for daylight and uh, and sunset. Um, so it's pretty cool. You know, you still need UVB. You still need a heat lamp. It's not accomplishing any of that. It's just for pure cool coolness. That's all it is. It's just to be cool. Like I said, you can give your animal a day-night cycle. So I'd say that's beneficial. It'll do that on its own. Um, you can do weather patterns like thunderstorms, stuff like that. Don't know really that that benefits the animal any, but it's still pretty cool. Um, and you can really adjust that light to whatever color you like for day and night. And then once I hit auto again, it'll go to my programming, which is my day color, my night color, um, and the timer rising and setting the sun. So that's what it does. It's pretty cool. It's easy to program. Um, comes with good instructions. It's lightweight. It doesn't take up a lot of space at all. Like this is on top of a 40 breeder critter cage and it only covers the little screen door. I mean, it's very small, lightweight. Doesn't put off a lot of heat, which can be good if you already have heat lamps in place. You don't need more heat. Um, and it, it's just neat. So I like it. It's nice. The fit and finish of it is good. It's lightweight. It should be very low electrical draw from this thing. Um, and it's just kind of cool and it's different than any of the other lights you're going to get. So if you want something to do, it'd be awesome on like a natural, naturalistic enclosure, like maybe a bio, um, you know, some kind of bio type or a bioactive enclosure you know you could do um, you could do dart frogs with it you could do pretty much anything anything that you want to do a cool display where you want to have a day and night cycle you think the sound effects are kind of cool um, in your reptile room it's pretty neat I mean it's you know I get it and it's not very expensive I think it's like 60 bucks so it's not expensive it seems pretty good quality the purpose you know is a little Kind of minimal, you know, as far as the practical thing that the light does. No UVB, no heat, but cool effects, cool timer, day-night cycle, very tunable. You can make the light exactly the way you like it, day and night, and you can do weather, and you get sound effects. So it's, it's pretty cool. Um, I wouldn't, I would recommend it. I mean, it seems like a nice little thing. I mean, if you've already got heat and UVB, and you're just wanting something to make your tank look visually better. I think it's, you know, it's cool. So anyway, check that out. Um, we got this from Reptile Wholesale uh, Supply online and I wanna say it was, like I said, around 60 bucks. It wasn't very expensive at all. So anyway, thanks for watching. Um, let me know what you guys think about it if y'all try it out. And uh, like and subscribe.